blocks the C4. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, this is another Blast from the Past video. This was taken in Fort McClellan, Alabama in early 2001. So anyway, um, this is Fort McClellan right here. I just figured I'd put it up here behind me. And from what I understand, it's no longer even a military base. It was shut down for chemical contamination or something. And I'm not even sure where the demolition range is that we went to, but if anybody knows, if you were stationed at Fort McClellan, let me know in the comments. But anyway, here's the video. I hope you enjoy it. Sorry for the bad video quality. It's uh, really, it's vintage, you know, army stuff. And it was a little, I had no idea what I was doing with the camera. Kind of still don't, but I'm getting a little bit better. So anyway, let me know if you like it in the comments with a, a thumbs up. If you don't like it, if you don't like these blast from the past videos, I got a lot of videos from back then. If you don't like them, give me a thumbs down so, you, so I know not to keep posting them. So anyway, here we go. Enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Roll with clean hands into small, smallest diameter. What if your hands are Insert tapered ear, tapered in quickly into ear canal. Hold until fully expanded. Multex metric incorporated. These are the barracks we're staying in, right there. This is Fort McClellan, Alabama. And we're going out to blow shit up. Be back with you in a few. All right, this is Sergeant Kennedy's little bunny rabbit here. <laughs> 30 seconds! Oh, are those blocks of C4? <laughs> <laughs> you are a long block? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Hey, where's my four fires? Four fires, get up there! Cut shot too, guys. Push it on the plunger. Quarter turn left or right. 
Ready, ready, pull. Pull safety Oop. pin. Push it on the plunger. Quarter turn left or right. Ready, ready, pull. Pull safety pin. Pull hard. There you go. Push it on the plunger. Push in. Turn the quarter turn left or right. Ready, ready, pull. them up and start piling them up over here for more. All right, sapper. Go ahead and take a piss break, smoke break, two minutes back in the bleachers. I need a I need a shape charge right over here. I'm the one putting the ice on her back. <laughs> Shape charge. You're the one she's putting the boot in your ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Do I have everybody back? If you're not back, say something. Got a lot more stuff to do, all right? So let's, I'm going to give you a break. Get over and get it. Get back in here. All right. Next thing we're going to do is shape charges. Shape charges come in two sizes. What are they? Pound or 15 pounds? Airborne. 40 pound or 15 pound. Which one do I have in front of me? 15. 15 pound, right? Yeah. That's what they can carry. They come with a standoff. Supposed to be the perfect standoff, right? If it's soft ground, go ahead and use it. We're using today. So what you need to do if it's harder ground, you got to get the shape up higher. So you can take some sticks, cut them, you can make a tripod or make four legs. And get it up about 18 inches or so. Maybe, maybe even do a test shot. You may even have to go a little higher, okay? <laughs> but when you do that, make sure it's level so the hole's straight, alright? Ain't nothing like getting in a crooked hole, right? Yeah. Cool. Cool. Alright, to prime these things, prior to popular belief, there's only one way to prime a shape. The top. With a cap, all right? See, people come up. Oh, I'll put a piece of C4 right here to go. Yeah, it'll go. But it's not going to make the hole you need to make, okay? This is going to blow the composition B up inside it. Huh? Oh. The 40 pound shapes, they come up and they're like like a round tin can that Bowie was eating out of the wall going on the top. You could actually wrap a depth cord around the top of it and make it go. But you probably won't get the hole that you need. This thing is designed to go straight in the middle of the charge, shoot the charge. See how it's cone? It inverts. It inverts and it drills your hole, huh? huh? This particular one, the 15s, the cone is made out of glass. Explosives in there behind it, who? Huh? The 40 pounders, the cone is made out of copper. <coughs> we got any of those? So a lot of people, when they make expedient shapes, we'll get to some other time in life, they'll put a penny in the cone of it to help. Who? Huh? Why? Give that copper, give you something to make Push it hotter, it I guess. Actually, I think they're crazy, but they do it for the hell out of who? Ooh. Now, usually in your demo bags, you got primer that. If you had a demo box, that's where they're supposed to go. Right? They took them out of the demo bags. But if I was you, I'd keep at least a bag of them in there because you can still use the primer that for some TNT and the shape. So all we're going to do is going to place <coughs> this cap. All the way in there to a seated, right? Yeah. Today, I'm not going to do it up here. I don't trust myself that much, all right? Today, after we do that, I'll come by with tape. 
the other one. He's carrying the guy. He's back at work. Just cut it. You know? fine powder that's in there. That's how much powder is inside of about a foot piece. Not much at all. Mm. No. Not much. That's the reason you, you don't don't really if you don't have to don't cut it with a knife that way. You can take and put it down on something and you know, rock the knife across it because mm. if you jerk it and it, it slips out and shakes the powder out. We have a misfire. Come on, Luther, we got everybody! Stand over here. Do we have everybody? Yeah. On three, three fire in the hole. One, two, three. Fire in the hole! Fire in the hole! Fire in the hole! Ha, ha, ha. 
can. Another 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 can. Get you a piece of rope, five feet and a quarter or something, tie it here, and lower it into the hole. They're uh, drop proof now. See that outline there? What goes there? C4, C4 TNT, or dynamite, right? They've even got it on both sides. You gotta put a minimum of one on here, okay? I guess you gotta do two now, they ain't got the things on it. Where's right. that cord? Can't do it. It's pushed over 40 pound limit. <laughs> 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 All right, stand corrected. There used to be a little thing where deck cord runs through, and comes lurched around with a Uli knot on it. That was your first way of priming. Who? Cool. Then you slap a block of C4 or TNT or dynamite on the other side of it. And if anybody's done their uh, crater and charge formulas lately, how much exposure goes in the hole? How many pounds? 41 and a quarter. 50, right? 50. But if you do your formula for a hasty throw crater, how many pounds per hole? So I've got to put this, my booster charge, and some more explosives in the hole, right? I'm going to do that today. We will put two two blocks on it, okay? You will use a, a Uli knot or a triple roll knot. One of those two. I'm going to make sure both both block the C4 go. So now I need two instead of one per. <coughs> they put this shit on here for a reason. It don't work half the time. But we'll see. Wouldn't it be better to get your knot uh, stuff in there first? Yeah, it would. I just want to show you how it sticks on there. <laughs> I can't even get it off. <laughs> That's a working problem with you guys. I, I'm different there. Cool. But tape it. Cool. Let's tape it. Questions? Alright, let's get it and go. They got a lot of stuff there now. Yeah, they got the six and five or six years ago. Yeah, Fayetteville sucks. Fayetteville sucks. Fayetteville sucks. Fayetteville sucks. But Fort Bragg is a good post. Yeah. There's plenty to do on post, ain't there? What's that? There's plenty to do on post. Oh, yeah, you go bowling and, and drinking, whatever you want to do. In the barracks, how's that? This is private, supposed to have one, right? Or are you a sergeant? Private. Come here, private sergeant. Randy, is there an extra one? Move the truck, so serious. Engineers, let's do that, sir. Listen up. Don't move until all the debris stops falling, okay? Uh, you better get over here somewhere, because I'm going to be walking around right here. Y'all fly down right here.
I think I got it. I think I got it. Where at? I think I count out teams now. I think. Now someone stand up. Nah, that's it. They're taking your. It's all blurry. And Can you manually? Here he goes. Is that what he said? <laughs> 